Gulab jamun is one recipe that we all enjoy but sometimes the process seems a little longer. Today I'm going to show you a very simple recipe that we can quickly make and enjoy that is bread gulab jamun. So let's get started and check out the recipe. For the bread gulab jamun, first I'm going to cut the bread slices. I've taken four large slices. Uh, this is white bread, uh, more like a sandwich bread. If you like, you can also use brown bread or sweet bread. Cut off the ends. So cut the bread slices into small pieces. To this, I'm going to add some milk at room temperature. Now this is unsweetened milk, it's just plain milk that's been boiled and cooled. Just add about a quarter cup initially. I'm just going to mix everything together until it's well combined. We're just going to soften the bread pieces. You can see the bread pieces have absorbed the milk. You don't need too much milk, just a little. Mash the bread pieces along with the milk till it forms a dough. If you feel the dough is extremely dry while mixing, a teaspoon of milk just to get the moisture in. So you can see I've mixed it like a nice thick dough. So now I'm going to shape it into small round balls. You can shape it to desired size. First I'm going to make the sugar syrup. For this I've taken one and a half cups of water. To this I'm going to add one cup of sugar. The sugar is dissolved completely. Now I'm going to add half teaspoon of cardamom powder, a few drops of rose essence, add a few strands of saffron, the sugar syrup is ready, keep it aside. Once the oil is hot, I'm going to fry the rolled bread balls. Keep the flame on medium and deep fry till you get a nice golden brown color. Add the fried bread balls into the sugar syrup so that the jamuns are completely immersed in the sugar syrup. Let it soak in the sugar syrup for a minimum of 30 minutes to an hour. The sugar syrup should be hot while putting the bread jamuns into the syrup. So there you go, here are these perfectly delicious bread gulab jamuns that can be made in minutes and you can enjoy it while they're still warm and moist. You can get a copy of our first edition of the home cooking book on 21 Frames.